I'm Abra Papa for NutritiousAmerica.com, and this is my kale obsession. So I'm going to make a kale salad with roasted fall roots and pine nuts. This is a good one, a really good one. I'm gonna start by making a dressing. So what I have here is a whole head of roasted garlic. I just simply slice the top off the garlic, put it in a tin foil wrap with olive oil, salt and pepper, and roasted it at 425 for 40 minutes. This is how we start. You just squeeze this entire head of garlic. I know, seems like a lot of garlic, but you'll thank me once you try this. Into our little bowl. And then I'm going to add to that some fresh orange juice. This is a big orange here. Okay. Oh, it smells so good. There's nothing like fresh citrus. Okay. And fresh thyme. Just sort of peel a couple of these guys off. And now just need to whisk this. Just going to kind of mash that roasted garlic down until it forms a paste. And it literally just will completely incorporate into this orange juice. A pinch of sea salt. Two pinches of sea salt. And some black pepper. Okay, and then work this in. Might take a minute, but it's worth it. This is very, very worth it. So what I love about this recipe is that it's an extraordinarily healing recipe. Every element of this recipe is jam-packed with different nutrients to support a different body system. So it might not be something that you're so jazzed about listening to, but it's something that I get really jazzed about making and serving to my friends and family. <laughs> so here we go, I'm gonna get you excited about it. So the roasted garlic, there is almost no better immunity boosting food than garlic. And I'm giving you an entire head of roasted garlic. And when you roast it, it's not quite as pungent and doesn't upset your digestion as much as raw garlic. Then we need some olive oil. And I'm just gonna whisk this in, this is about a half a cup of olive oil. And I'll definitely add a little bit more orange juice to this because I can tell it's going to need more acid. So that's the garlic. The garlic is this powerful immunity food. And we want to support our immune system, right? In cold and flu season, if you're feeling a little bit sluggish, bump up your garlic, your garlic intake. You'll see a big difference. Okay, that's our awesome dressing. And then here's the rest of the salad. Here's what I've done. I've roasted four beets in the oven at 425 for 40 minutes with olive oil, salt and pepper and thyme. Beets, they're your liver food. So wonderful for detoxification. Then I've roasted an entire head of fennel. Fennel is your digestive support. Um, if you're having any kind of digestive issues at all, fennel is a wonderful food to support that system. And then of course, my king of all foods, of vegetables certainly, is kale. So kale is jam-packed with so many antioxidants, nutrients, calcium, iron, that this is gonna just sort of balance out all this other healing that's going on. So this is pretty simple. So I have the fennel, I also roasted on the same tray as my beets, same idea, 425 for 40 minutes. You're just going to wanna make sure that you check on it a couple of times and give it a little spin. I'll take these whole pieces of thyme off. And then I'm just going to add the beets to my kale. The kale is um, washed, pulled from the stems, and I actually chop this into really tiny, oh, beet just went in the dressing, that's all right, into really tiny ribbons, because I wanted the kale to be small in this salad, because it's an element of the salad, but the real big star here is the beet. So I want the beets to shine. So that's why I made the kale a bit smaller. Then all of this fennel goes in. And I bet you're wondering, how is she going to mix all of that in that small bowl? And I'm wondering the same thing. <laughs> but I'll find a way. Okay. I'm gonna do it very carefully, that's how I'm gonna do it. We need the dressing. Get this 
rogue beet in here. And you can see that that garlic is really incorporated now. Oh my gosh, this smells so incredible. If you're a garlic fan, you have to try this. Even if you're not a garlic fan. If you're not a garlic fan, maybe don't use the entire head. Maybe just use a couple of cloves. That's the great thing about cooking now, is that, you know, as far as I'm concerned, a recipe is a guideline. That's all. It's an idea. It's a guideline. You don't have to follow it to the T. If you have a different idea, do your idea. Okay, a couple more elements to the salad, but we're going to add them on the plate. Let's move this aside. Here we go. So we have kale, beets, fennel, roasted garlic, orange thyme dressing. I'm going to add to that some orange segments or orange supremes, these are called. Just for a little extra hit of orange. Finished with some pine nuts. There it is. Time for the taste. This is the ultimate test, right? I hope there's lots of garlic in this bite. Mmm. You definitely taste the garlic, but in the best way. When you roast it, the sweetness of the garlic comes out. The beets are phenomenal. Just a little hint of that thyme. And then the fennel gives it an interesting, fennel tastes a little bit like black licorice, which I love. And of course, the orange juice is that perfect amount of sweet and acid. That's it. A kale salad with roasted fall roots and pine nuts. I'm Abra Papa from NutritiousAmerica.com. Eat your greens and have a delicious day.